This is going to be the first episode of the ZX-10 Rescue. You may not watch it all the way through, so I'm going to ask my questions up front. I really don't know what's going on with this gas tank. This bike sat for 10 to 12 years. Is that rust coming through? Leaking was on this side. The bike was parked, leaned over this way. Although there's this one that's actually rusty. So these bubbles are hard. Do I need to get rid of the paint here and look at these first before even putting in fuel to see if they're gonna leak or not. Any help with what I should do next with the gas tank would be awesome. Like subscribe if you want to keep up with the build, rescue, whatever you want to call it. It starts off with uh, me pulling the bike from the side of the house where it's been parked since the start of last winter. It's May now. Dealing with red ants. I'm talking about the, it's like a real red ant. Okay. Red ants can <laughs> actually break through your shoes. Oh. Hi. What's up, everybody? We're here trying to get the next project started. This is the Mirchi Boys next project bike, and it's been stuck in the side of the house for the entire winter. Pretty cool story of uh, how I got it. We can get into that later, but this bike is from Ohio. Down in Ohio, that's where I like Ohio. <laughs> okay, that's interesting. <gasps> do you want to do anything? Mm -hmm. You want to like get a corner? Uh, I can't even do anything for my pants. Spider. Here it is. This is a 1989 Kawasaki Ninja ZX10. Mirchi Mama wanted something for the yard. Since spring is here, she got she got something for the yard. Flying spider. Well, we'll we'll be seeing him later. I can see him. I can see him. He's in there. That's a good looking bike. Nice. Anything for uh, Mirchi Mama, you know, she wants that. Uh, it isn't anywhere close to working. Zero gravity windscreen, Vanson Heinz exhaust, Corbin seat. A few things have been powder coated red. I'm trying to get into that gas tank, it almost bent one and only working key. ZX10. This is a B model, the A model, GPZ 1000 RX. Braun Old Fingers bike. It turned into a bad boy. Come 88, 89, 90. But when we get this will, you know, whatever the record was in 1988, 89, it held it. A lot of bubbling. You can smell gasoline. I think it's been dripping here on the frame. Something for the gas This is an overflow. It should be good. So it's these pinholes here if you want to show. What are pinholes? The pinholes are these little bubbles. And on the other side, I think it's been leaking. Here you can see on the frame here, this varnish. If you want to show this here, right there. So I think this tank might be toast, uh, which is unfortunate because they're probably, they're like. This is a nice tank though. It like, it is the Kawasaki OG Ninja tank. Absolutely right. So it's just that Tank repair and pinhole repair is beyond what I can do. Uh, but we can work on some of the other things while we figure out what to do 
with the tank and also we can see how bad these pinhole leaks are looks really old it's a four cylinder there's a leaf all right well this is a good stopping point we got the tank off for the first time we'll take a look dump out the old gas see how bad it is we'll keep working on the bike and we'll figure out what to do with the tank